<laughs> What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another MLB The Show 21 video and as always if you a real one drop a like on the video if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button and turn your channel notifications on today I'm about to help y'all get 18 to 21,000 XP. It's gonna feel like double XP is still activated. I went in the lab, I tried three or four different methods. Now, after the video, I did find the best method. And I will tell y'all that a little later, so lock in. Pay attention to everything that I'm telling you after you drop a like on the video, man. I'm here to help y'all out. So, we are doing the intentional walk method. It's a lot of videos on my channel about the full breakdown, hardwiring one of your controllers, making sure you got two controllers, all that type of good stuff. One of your controllers do disconnect. You're going to see at the end of this video, so you got to pay attention and watch to the end of the video exactly what you want to do. Now, with this method, SDS went and tried to patch it and take away the XP from a lot of people, but now you just have to play more innings so instead of you getting done in 22 to 24 minutes you have to do the 28 to 30 minute threshold every single time it's going to help you get between 38 and 42,000 xp every single hour now you can see i am checking my hits the threshold you want to hit is six innings or higher and 10 hits or higher so if you get to inning seven and you get to 15 or 20 hits and i mean just bunting load the bases up intentional walk to 100 runs bunt 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 just repeat it load the bases up let yourself get out you get up and pitch get into another inning pitch 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 do this in 25 to 50 run increments after you get past 100 runs or you can get all the way to 200 runs and then start it now what to pay attention to is after you get three outs see if your xp is tracking at the top left of the screen if it does it one time if it does it three time make sure it's tracking if you get to inning number three or inning number four and you never see your xp track in the top left exit out of the game and don't waste your time because if you don't see any kind of xp tracking the servers might be offline also people have been saying I'm not getting but I'm not getting but six or seven thousand XP after doing 250 or 300 runs. That's because your controller is more than likely becoming inactive. You are not using the every 50 run method where I tell you to have the other controller next to you reach over and just push a button, push up, push down, push left, push right, put A, push B, some kind of button to keep that controller activated. If you're not gonna hardwire it, I hardwire it now. You want to get 250 runs. It's best at 275 runs, and it's best at six innings or more, and it's best at 10 hits or more. If you go above that to 300 runs, 15 or 20 hits, or 15 to 20 bunts, if you go eight innings, you will hit the 22,000 XP threshold, and it might be 32 to 34 minutes, but still, you will get 40 plus thousand xp every single hour so what is y'all waiting on drop a like on the video rewind this pay attention to the video why you are doing the method so you can know exactly how it works let's go